Jed here to talk about the settings available with the GoTo mobile app. I should note that GoTo continues to release new products and features all the time. With that in mind, the settings of the app will constantly be changing. I'll be providing an overview of the settings that are available as of August 2022. Also, the settings available to you largely depend on what products are available with your plan. This video will focus on those which have a GoToConnect account, which also has access to meetings. I've already signed in as the user Ryan Noble, and this is the home screen of the mobile app. To access settings, tap the profile picture in the top left corner. This is the main settings screen. Some of what you see here is for informational purposes only, like what active extension is being used, and those cannot be changed from this screen. Here are the settings for silencing your device or enabling Do Not Disturb. Please be aware that when you activate a setting here, it will also be enabled for your GoTo desktop app. Tap here if you want to sync your Microsoft 365 or Google Calendar with GoTo. Doing so will allow the app to notify you of upcoming meetings with a valid GoTo address in the details. Tap the phone option. Here are the settings that relate to using the GoTo device as your business phone. Many of these settings are self-explanatory, but let me draw attention to a few of them. Find Me Follow Me allows you to set up a call flow for when someone dials your extension. For example, a call will first come to your phone, and then you can designate where it will go to next if you are unable to answer. That can be something like a different internal extension or external number like a cell number or even directly to a voicemail box. From the block numbers section, you can add numbers that you do not want to ring through to your phone and provide details about them. You can later remove the block if needed. This section for call options deals with deciding if you want to use your Wi-Fi connection or cellular network when using the app. If your system administrator has set up instant response option for you, you can automatically send a text message to missed calls from first-time callers. In this instance, that permission has not been given yet. Let's check out the voicemail settings. Here's where you can record your voicemail greeting. And as you can see here, there are three different types. Finally, tap Meetings. From here you can change your display name if needed and set up session reminders. That's all there is to a quick overview of the settings available to you when using the GoToMobile app.